Okay, hi Netta, hi Baton friends. Uh, rather than writing you a novel on Facebook, I decided I'm just gonna go grab my baton and my iPad and just shoot a video. Because, you know, it's really hard to describe all the little intricate details that we need to get done to make our monsters happen. So I might as well just show you. I don't know, tell me what you think. Um, so some of the things we need to think about is, first of all, being patient enough with your arm up here waiting for that roll to come around. A lot of times I see people trying to stand up too soon and that's when it gets caught in your ribs. And if you've ever experienced that, which I'm sure you have by now, you get to here and then it comes up and you're like, why does it keep hitting my ribs? Well, it's because you're standing up too soon. You gotta wait for it. You gotta let that roll complete its circle, get into your neck, and then you can start standing up. Another thing which a lot of people have a little trouble with but I, th I think once you get the body mechanics of it, it's okay. But we gotta lunge into the opposite leg. So if my right arm is up, I gotta put my weight over top of my left foot so that I have the space, I have the momentum, I'm carrying my baton with me as I go into that monster. And then the same is for this side. My left arm goes up at the same time I'm taking a step into that right foot, putting my weight, transferring my center of gravity over top of that so it becomes a straight line from foot to hand now a lot of times we're we're going to be up in here and then it's not it's a lot harder to get over it starts hurting your back at least this way when you're lunging you can engage your core and you have a lot more stability and then you're not going to get into this like lower back rib pain um, lumbar thoracic spine um, the other thing is is i like to do it in progressions so i start here I go to this side, I open my arm, open my neck, let it roll, I wait, 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 feels like forever and that's okay, making sure my arm is pointing straight up to the ceiling. Give it time, it'll come into this open space in my neck, then I can let it roll and then I'll trap it here. I'll do a million of those, like literally a million. And then I'll do the other side, I'll do the same thing. Open it up, let this arm come up, lean over into this leg, same thing, straight up to the ceiling. Let it roll, let it give its time till it comes into your neck, and then you can get here. Now, if it's hitting your ribs, you have that instant feedback that that means that you're standing up too soon. If it's coming and hitting you in the face while you're still here, that means you're waiting a little bit too long. So you wanna find that sweet spot sort of in between. And then from there, it's just repetition. Just do it over and over and over again until your muscles, your brain, your body, your baton, I'll start working as one, okay? So, nice and long, open, open, and it'll come right into your neck. Hope that helped. Let me know. Okay, bye.